Welcome back. The National Human Rights Commission has commenced a human rights and civilian protection training for soldiers involved in the fight against insurgency in the Northeast. The commission says the training is being organized in collaboration with the United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees. A correspondent to Wulabia Denusi has more. The Nigerian military has been accused of not strictly complying with the rules of engagement in theaters where operations are underway against insurgency and banditry. The Human Rights Commission is taking steps to strengthen the capacity of soldiers to ensure they carry out their duties without infringing on the rights of the civil populace. The justification for this training cannot be overemphasized. The war against insurgency is complicated by the asymmetric nature of the conflict. The insurgents and the civilian uh, population. There is therefore an extreme need to prosecute the insurgency operation to win the hearts and minds of the civilian population of Nigeria. This underscores the importance of this training for mainstreaming respect for human rights norms and civilian protection into the counter insurgency operations. The United Nations Refugee Agency has condemned the growing displacement of people worldwide due to violent conflict and says the UNHCR remains committed to supporting displaced persons in the Northeast and other areas of conflict in the country. It's to provide us an opportunity to evaluate our activities and reinforce the societal reform aimed at improving the lives of the affected population and the optimal combination of ensuring humanitarian assistance and a boost in the counterinsurgency strategy that mitigates impact on affected population rather than targets them indiscriminately. Military officials involved in the training have commended the commission and have pledged to continue to operate in line with the rules of engagement and respect for human rights and humanitarian norms. Residents of communities affected by the insurgency have also commended UNHCR's activities. As a fighting force, and one of our role as the military is the protection of life and property, and also the protection of our territorial integrity. And also as a fighting force, we all believe here this morning that our function is also in line with the policy of the National Human Rights Commission. And I say thank you this morning. The military is fighting a war to push back insurgents and bandits in the north, operations in which the enemy has often used civilians as human shields.